Trump is a whining, sniveling little baby who likes to dish it out but can't take it. In this video he attacks the press who, in Trump's opinion, are out to get him. Here are the classic characteristics of an adult bully. Think he qualifies? Duh. 1. Manipulates through seduction. 2. Intimidates through verbal aggression. 3. Uses political gamesmanship. 4. Plays mind games. 5. Disguises true intentions and emotions. I've been dealing with the press a long time. I think the political press is among the most dishonest people that I've ever met. The people don't trust you, and the people don't trust the media. She starts asking me all sorts of ridiculous questions, and you know, you could see there was blood coming out of her eyes, uh, blood coming out of her wherever. I have the right to ask the question. No, you, know, the question. you haven't been called. No, I, have the, I have the right to ask the question. Go back to you. No. And he stood up and started ranting and raving like a madman. He was totally, absolutely out of line. Donald Trump under fire again, this time for seeming to mock a reporter's disability. Oh, the poor guy, you got to see this guy. Oh, I don't know what I said. Oh, I don't remember. The mainstream media, these people back here, they're the worst. They are so dishonest. No, no, they're so dishonest. And, and by the way, some of the media is terrific. But most of it, 70 percent, 75 percent, is absolute dishonest, absolute scum. Remember that. Scum. Scum. They're totally dishonest people. She's back there. Little Katie, she's back there. What a lie it was. No, what a lie. Katie Turr, what a lie it was from NBC to have written that was a total lie. But let me tell you about the Wall Street Journal. I have no respect whatsoever for the Wall Street Journal. I don't think they know what they're doing. Uh, they have taken me on so much. It's so ridiculous. Uh, Every day, editorials, bad editorials. I don't even want to read it very much anymore. They are so wrong. We're going to open up those libel laws so that when the New York Times writes a hit piece, which is a total disgrace, or when the Washington Post, which is there for other reasons, writes a hit piece, we can sue them and win money. By the way, the world's most dishonest people are back there. Look at all the cameras going. Look at all those cameras. Unbelievable. They are dishonest. Most of them, not all of them, but most of them. I'm not looking for credit. But what I don't want is when I raise millions of dollars, have people say, like this sleazy guy right over here from ABC. He's a sleaze in my book. You're a sleaze because you, you know the facts and you know the facts well. It was very unfair that the press treated us so badly. Oh, go ahead. The world does very little when despots take over foreign countries. But this one is in our own backyard. This man is dangerous. Very dangerous. He wants power. He wants control. And he'll say anything and do anything to get it. He is very adept at manipulating people. You think he cares about the common person? You think he has empathy for the average person? Really? Why? He has one goal. To bullshit as many people as possible to get control of the White House. He is a con man. And if you buy into his crap, then you're the sucker.